are starting Hellbrook and Chris, what do you think? Here we go, let's go, woo! Right now. So far we've been moving maybe 30 minutes and as you can tell, I'm breathing really hard, but I consider myself a pretty good athlete and I live at 7,000 feet elevation. So my heart is racing. This is definitely straight up. It's like walking upstairs for 30 minutes, but it's beautiful. It's rock stairs and we wouldn't have it any other way, would we, Paula? We love it. Best ever. I'll show you what we are coming up. You cannot really tell, but this is... <laughs> This is straight up, so I don't know how we're going to get down it. That's going to be the I issue. Know. Whoops, it was not on. Iron rungs. Chris is already up there. I can do it, but it's my turn. We just had to go across this super slick ledge of slate. Here we are. We're maybe above Stowe. It is an incredible view cut into the mountain rock. We just came up this. You cannot tell, but it was the hardest trail I've ever done. Okay, Chris, what are you gonna So I've done describe? this trail before and obviously the regular trail got washed out. So we're just kind of climbing up stuff I've never done before. A lot of scrambling, definitely not for the faint of heart. Definitely the most technical hiking trail I've ever done, but amazing, glad we're out here and uh, let's go finish this, Paula. It is straight up rock faces sometimes with nothing to hold on to. And that is true, we saw that in the description. There are no handholds in some spots and there are no trees. And sometimes you lose the trail because it is covered with shrubbery but it is so beautiful up here I've also never done a prettier hike okay so look at this my hair is soaking wet and it is filled with like leaves probably poison ivy oil looking good we're going up here now I have to climb up this we're always grabbing onto nope, these yep. rocks but look this. We're going up this. The you can't arrows, tell, the blue arrows, right? but this is literally straight up a rock. Nothing to hold on to. <sighs> Can anyone see this? This is pure rock face. Down, 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 down. I don't know if you can tell, but it goes straight down without anything to grab onto. And then here we go on the regular trail. There's Chris. Taking a picture of the crazy thing we just came up. I don't think I'd even want my kids doing this because I I would never take my dog on that trip. Can you see this? It is the most pristine place you've ever seen. You literally just climbed up this rock cliff. I don't even want to go any closer. We climbed up this rock cliff and there was a crevice right next to us that we had to cross over. 
I'm too scared to even go over there. But look at this view. <laughs> Woo! All right. But I just don't remember it being that. I believe it is the steepest like stretch of trail in the world. Oh, okay. Yeah. We just so, did the steepest stretch of trail. So that does not surprise me. <laughs> All these people did not come up the trail, though. There's a parking lot very close to here, which is crazy. This over here is Lake Champlain. So we missed the turn off for the profanity trail because the sign here is not there. It's obviously there, but I was heads down. And so we just did a little extra hiking, saw some nice extra views. And Had another uphill, uphill climb. Yeah, hey. We needed the workout. We needed the workout. Okay, so we let's go. Have a big dinner tonight. <laughs> this is the boardwalk on the profanity trail. This is part of the profanity trail and it's not hard at all, but literally the entire thing is climbing down all these rocks and some of them are really flat and steep like this one and you got to sit down. But look at the view. Look at how pretty it is. We just made it to the Taft House. It's like a little place you can stay if you're so taking a pack on the trail. long trail. All right, we are done. We completed that Halbrook Trail. So we're done? To, and we went up to the Chin yeah. and we saw Mount Mansfield. And it was, it was the best hike I've ever done. The second half of it was a little bit tiring, but Chris is going to give us her final verdict. My final verdict. Well, yes, we're done. We're showered. We're, you're drinking tea. I'm drinking wine as usual. <laughs> it was an amazing hike. I have to say it was challenging and um, we lost the trail a little on the way up. The way down, I was definitely ready to be done because my knees my old knees were starting to hurt going some of that steep stuff down, but it was just perfect weather, um, perfect company. All Paula right. pushes me all the time, and great. We're ready for, we had two days of great hiking. We're ready for some more hiking, I think. Well, that means we that. are definitely <laughs> ready. We are uh, not I don't know done. If my knees are, this but is we will the see. start of our tradition. Yes. All right, so, I love it. Great, the best hike so far. I mean, two days of just the most amazing hikes. I don't know how we can top that. We're going to try to, but we will see. We also right. have a little rain in the forecast, so we might have to take one day where we don't do so much. But All right, but we give Halbrook an A+. Plus. We loved it. We loved right. it. Most challenging hike I've ever done. <laughs> All right, perfect.